Hello children, let's start a new chapter, chapter number 6, Acids, Bases and Salts. In this chapter, you will learn about acids, bases, indicators, salts and neutralization reaction. Gear up. Every day, you eat so many varieties of food items. These food items could be curd, lemon juice, honey, sugar, etc. Do all these food items taste the same? I hope the answer is no. Can you think of the reason for the difference in taste? What do they generally contain? So students, let's try to answer these questions. Almost all that you use throughout the day is an acid or a base, whether it is a food or soap. However, there are few substances which are neither acidic nor basic in nature and they are called neutral substances. So children, whatever you use throughout the day is either acidic or basic. But there are certain things which are neither acidic nor basic and they are called as neutral substances. For example, water. H2O is a neutral substance as it is neither acidic nor basic. Another example is salts. For example, NaCl that is sodium chloride. It is called as common salt. It is a neutral substance. Figure 6.1 Some commonly used substances Curd Vinegar Soft drink Amla Green apple Lemon Tamarind baking soda, sugar solution, salt solution. Students, let us perform an activity to understand the properties of different substances. Activity 1. Aim. To understand that different substances show different properties. Materials required. Substances shown in the figure 6.1 and other food items. Procedure. Taste each food item. Note your observation and complete the table given alongside. You have to complete this table. Note if all the substances taste the same. I'll be naming the substance and you have to tell whether the food substance taste salty, sweet, sour or bitter. The first substance is curd. It is already given in the table that it tastes sour. Second is vinegar. Write the taste in the table. Soft drink. Amla Green apple, lemon, tamarind, baking soda, sugar solution and salt solution. Observation and conclusion. Some substances taste salty while others taste sweet. Some taste sour while other taste bitter. Different substances have different properties. Note, you should not taste any substance unless you are asked to do so. Now let's understand why different substances have different taste. For that, we'll start with acids. Substances like lemon, vinegar, curd 
etcetera taste sour do you know why it is because these substances contain chemicals called acids and these acids make the food item sour in taste the term acid comes from the latin word acer which means sour all acids have a sour taste we find acids all around us that is in chemical laboratories food stuffs homes factories and even inside our body isn't that shocking do you know that an acid called hydrochloric acid with the formula hcl hydrochloric acid is present inside your stomach which helps you to digest your food now can you think of a reason why people generally complain of acidity after having a heavy meal the sour taste of lemon or orange is due to the presence of citric acid green apples are sour due to the presence of malic acid table 6.1 gives you the names of certain substances and acids present in them so let's have a look at that table table 6.1 some natural sources of acids sour milk it contain lactic acid curd lactic acid citrus fruits like orange amla lemon etc they contain citric acid can you correlate the name of citric acid and citrus fruit unripe green apples malic acid tamarind tartaric acid spinach oxalic acid sting of ant and bee formic acid vinegar acetic acid tea tannic acid lettuce leaves folic acid now pause the video and and read the name of the acids corresponding to the substances loudly i hope you all understood that acids are the chemicals which give sour taste to the food items most acids used in the laboratory are corrosive corrosive means they may attack some substances that is they are very reactive in nature acid may even burn your skin but all acids are not dangerous as you have seen in table 6.1 there are acids which are present in food item and they are edible acids hence are not dangerous before moving on to the properties of acids let's read something about acids acids are of two types one mineral acids and the second type is organic acids example of mineral acids are hcl h2so4 that is hydrochloric acid and sulfuric acid examples of organic acids are the acids which are present in food item so you can refer to table 6.1 for examples of organic acids before digging into the topic acids you should be familiar with three main mineral acids the first one is hcl capital h capital c and a small l it is hydrochloric acid next acid is H2SO4 capital H capital S capital O this is sulfuric acid and the last 
एच एन ओ थ्री कैपिटल एच कैपिटल एन कैपिटल ओ इट इज नाइट्रिक एसिड चिल्ड्रन पॉज दिस वीडियो एंड मेमोराइज ऑल द थ्री एसिड्स I hope children the video was helpful we have always heard about acid and wondered what it is in actual so this is the time when you will actually understand what this chemical acid is we will continue this topic in the next video till then enjoy learning and stay safe